What's up guys, my name is Master Rolfus and it's time we continue clearing Europe of the German Horde and the Austrian Horde that plagues it in the Great War mod. When we lost left off, I think we were killing the Austrians. Yep, we were killing the Austrians and we won. Hey, even though there was a couple of bullshit things that were happening here and there. Britain continues to be a giant douche or rather the United Kingdom. Jake Collingwood, you are a failure. However, your volunteers look pretty darn cool. But because they're volunteers, they also have sucky stats. Highlander Battalion, look at that. Oh wait, they're old and outdated. Nope, never mind. Now then, what is next on the agenda? Shall we go ahead and kill uh, this army over here? Or should we go and kill this army? It's a little bit tough to call which army to actually go ahead and attack. Like, first and foremost, I would love to besiege and conquer Brandenburg, but that doesn't seem like it's going to happen anytime soon due to the fact that there's a massive amount of troops here and a massive amount of troops over there and in order for us to race on over and defeat Max Hoffman and have time to defeat Brandenburg it's just gonna take a, a long amount of time like to race back and forth between the battlefield well hold on let me let me just check this out really quick one two three couple of artillery yeah maybe if you had very little troops here and my guys were a little bit more fresh. But right now, I, I just don't see us winning a battle. I mean, the arm systems are also a little bit annoying, to say the least. Maybe we could win it, actually. It, it definitely does depend. You know, we do have machine guns and some howitzers. I guess it's worth a try. Let's go try it out. That means we have to get our machine guns running as soon as possible. Wait a minute. Oh, he's in a box. He's in a fucking box. This is good. I can race on over to where the armies are reinforcing. Oh, and I actually see his troops. Okay. I like this already. I like this entire idea. So how about this? Let's go ahead and flabbergast the crap out of him by having some machine gun teams set up right over there, destroying his artillery regiments. Then we can have the rest of our machine gun team set up right over here. And we'll have the howitzers set up in the back of the back. We don't need them to be at the front lines because they are howitzers. So they can shoot over weather, the sir. units and stuff like that. Powder makes me spy as a certainty. Now then. Rifle infantry, I need you guys to set up like so. On this side. Just to make sure that you can get to where the enemies are reinforcing as fast as possible. And the same with you. That's pretty much about it. Maybe we could win this. It definitely does depend. All right, let's get a move on. Three, uh, two, uh, one. Oh, whoopsie daisy. We almost made a big mistake. Hold on a tick. Actually, I kind of want to move these guys to the edge. Right over here. A little bit better. Three, uh, two, one, uh, action. Now, where are they? There's my reinforcements, but where are his? This doesn't really help me. I'll check over the map, actually. Let's see. Reinforcements, reinforcements, reinforcements. Trees don't tell me anything. Trees, why? Hold on, he has to be somewhere. Somewhere over the rainbow. Oh, no, wait. Maybe he's not getting reinforcements now because he has a full regiment of units. Are we actually pelting these guys? Like, are we actually getting some kills? I just realized that the mountains are kind of blocking us. Now let's go ahead and move forward, actually. I didn't actually know that, but then again, uh, we were at our, ooh. there he is, there he is, those are Austrians, those aren't Germans, crap, no, don't dismount, not yet, not yet, butter bear, okay, let's move a little bit more further, Let's also support our rifle. Well, not our rifles, but let's support our machine gun teams like so. I 
Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't want to go into first person mode. Not yet. Not yet. Okay, now let's let the machine gun teams basically destroy the German armies. Since now they're a little bit closer. There we go. There we go. Okay, now the universe is all set and balanced. The avatar has arrived. The avatar has arrived. Whoa, hello, hello, hello. No, run, run, run. Don't walk. Why do you think walking is a good idea? Can I tell you something? It never is a good idea. Like, 9 out of 10 times, never a good idea to uh, walk instead of run. Unless you're at the pool, in which case, you might want to walk. Because then you might slip, fall down, and break your skull. Which I don't think is good. Well, I just realized something. These troops are way better than anything we've ever had. Now, are we on top of the hill yet? Oh, 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 wait, hold on. It's these guys. I need to go on top of the hill. Oh, there's... I think they can now fire upon the enemy, which is good. I'd like this one to get a little bit closer. Nope. Run. Don't walk. Good god, these guys are really good units. That doesn't matter though, we just need to eliminate the Germans over here and keep our machine gun teams alive for a little bit longer. Whoa, 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 broader bear, hello. A glorious victory, sir, is soon to be yours. Yeah, these highly trained Austrian troops are kicking my butt. I guess that's because they're highly trained Austrian troops. No. Ah, ha, ha, ha. There, there we are. Here they come. I didn't actually know that. They would come that way. Oh, we have a little bit of an issue now, do we? Crap. This is bad. We need to defeat the German armies that are reinforcing, but we also need to hold back the German armies that have been stationary for quite some time. Please fire upon him. There we go. One volley is all we need. Crap. They've basically destroyed our howitzers. Well, not destroyed our howitzers, but destroyed their ability to escape, which is all around pretty bad. Okay, that general came from over there. So we are so going in hot. Whoa! You're still alive, general? That is weird. I need you to set up chop over there. Come on, keep at it. Machine gun teams, hold strong. Hold strong in the face of adversity. These all street units are super good. General, this isn't hard, but can you please pistol whip these guys to shape? Please fire. Most of these units haven't fired yet. Sir! Sir! Our general is under attack! There we go. Now they're actually firing. And the reinforcements are finally coming. Ooh la la. Hello, hello, hello. We could be in a little bit of a daisy do situation now. General's finally gone to hell, which is good. But we are being flanked right now, which isn't exactly good. We're gonna be enclosed. 
a damn pinata. At least the Jaegers are gonna die, that's good. It always tickles my fancy when I see Jaegers dying. Machine gun teams, I believe in you. I believe. I just need to kill these rifle patrol units that are over there. I gotta set up quick. Yep, here comes the fuzz. And howitzers, please get back into position. Our men are running, sir. But where? Machine gun teams. But there. Flanked. Yep. That will happen. It's all falling apart because they're attacking from multiple sides. Oh, and the armed citizens were able to breach through. It's crazy. Why are the machine gun teams so ineffective against armed citizens? Basically, people armed with spoons and throwing knives. Our men are running, sir. Where? Yeah, this isn't good. Units are routing all over the place. We killed their generals, but it doesn't matter because our morale compared to theirs is pitiful. Oh well, this is the conquest of Brandenburg. It's not supposed to be easy. It would, however, be a little bit better if you guys got into a way more effective formation. How are the Jaegers still alive after losing so many dudes is beyond my comprehension. That's probably why the Jaegers are still alive. Okay, we dealt with the Austrians here. Good. Now let's race on back and try to save that machine gun team from basically getting raffle stomped. All Germans have been killed. Good. Now, let's bring our machine gun teams over here. So, we, so that we can hold back the horde. We have two German units there that we have to deal with. But right now is the end. Oh, who's still firing? Oh, it seems like you can't move. Okay. Can you move? No, it seems like you have that glitch where you can't move. Okay. Do me a favor and just stay stationary for now. Chill out. And kill the armed citizens coming in. Seems good? I think that's wonderful. Why are the rifle infantry still alive? That bugs me. Time to turn around, buddy boy. Guess who's coming forward? Jaegers. So why we need rifle tree now? Your machine guns, you can go back. Our rifle infantry over here are coming around to help us. In our most valued times, the brave French people will unite as one cohesive whole and fight our enemies. My question is, how are you still alive? You are obnoxious. Now just run down and take them out, for God's sakes. Holy moly, guacamole. Do we have anything on these eagers yet? No, we don't. We actually might actually lose a rifle infantry unit due to the fact that they're firing so much. And we have the arm. 
crap. Come on. I'm out already. Three, 30, 26, there we go. I focus on normal targets. And you guys probably go right over here. Oh, mortars coming in. And rifle retreat. Yep, that's not good. not good what the fuck guys do you really need to like form up another formation again uh, this is a pretty tense and close game if we don't get these machine guns over to the hill soon we could face a lot of bad things Just get close enough to fire upon them. How's that sound? Okay, just fire upon those Jaegers. Just the fact that we're getting basically flanked on three sides is kind of destroying my army. My French army used to be strong. Now French army is weak like pancake. I don't think anybody wants to be weak like a pancake. I think all the Germans are a tad stupid. They're moving into volley after volley after volley of Jaeger fire. Alright, only shell. Back the rifle for tree out of there. Go machine gun teams, go! There we go. Justice has been served. Now we can stem the tide of the German advance. Don't walk, run. Who walks? Especially when you have machine guns that are firing upon you. From your own side. It's like your nana walking forward. Slicing up a piece of cake and then takes a knife and you're like, oh, let me just take the knife and just shove it into my stomach. That doesn't work. Don't fire upon the mortars for God's sakes. Are you guys even in the Jaegers? Oh, somewhat, I guess. Alright, machine gun teams. Only shell. Because we're about to get flanked. And you're basically our only hope. No, no, no. Only shell means fire upon enemy German units, not the other way around. Oh my god, this is gonna be close. Finally, one army breaks. That is the best news I've seen all crappin' day. Flamethrowers? Oh no! We're about to be cooked alive like shish kebab! Okay. Even at point blank range, you guys are useless. my units just run just run to the battlefield run phew thank god for machine guns was it for my machine gun placement we'd probably be dead already basically luring the germans into a huge massive trap all right well spirit tactics aside We'll definitely win this due to our machine guns. Just gotta make sure that our machine guns last long enough. Machine guns over here will be able to fire at the Jaeger moving forward.
How with nine guys are you able to continue this fight? Like, I seriously gotta end the, that mortar team. Okay, we might have made a huge problem. Oh no, this is bad. By focusing on the mortar team for just a little bit, we've allowed him to get back. This could be a tad of a problem. Let's see if maybe the general can help. Come on, General. Of course you've used all of your ammunition. Here, let's get into melee mode. Against the combat engineers. Come on. Ungod! Ungod, savage! Now let's back the fuck off. We don't want to lose that. In general, at all. That would basically be the, the end of our entire campaign. The motors fucked us really badly. Oh, I gotta hand it to him. Having those motors stick around? That that really did a number on us. One flamethrower team, one mission. Move them all. Okay, well my rifle infantry units are coming in. We still have our motor team strutting about. Unfortunately, this assault squad doesn't know the concept of death. Same with the flamethrower team, I guess. Charge! There we go. Now back off really quick. Good God, this is this has been a close one. This has been really fucking close. We're we've basically conquered Brandenburg by the skin of our teeth. The strip in our boot. The dolphin in the in this um the, the fish tank. Wait, that, that didn't make sense. You don't put dolphins in a fish tank. What are you what are you advocating for, Master Rolfless? This is animal abuse. Alright, you know what? Let's speed this battle up. Because I know the outcome. You know the outcome. We all know the outcome. We all scream for ice cream. One of our units has Fuck yes! Oh my god, we did it. Against all odds, we have defeated the mighty German Empire. Let us loot the crap out of the city. Because occupying it peacefully will do nothing for us. And we get no happiness. Now then, let's go ahead and burn everything to the ground. Oh, I'm such a dick. Alright, stay in here. Wow. Okay, so this has been really really good Conquering Brandenburg has been a dream of mine. We can't hold it obviously, but We have pushed the Germans back quite a bit by holding Brandenburg yet again And we've looted the city as well. So that means I get more money to spend on useless shit like extensive rail systems or more troops Or better economy It's all around pretty good. That's what we need. We need to do the scrap. Oh, I can't have the university though. Oh well. At least we will have Heidelberg. That's another thing. We do need to defend Heidelberg against the Austrians who can burn it down again, which they do have a history of doing, burning down Heidelberg over and over and over again. Which makes me wonder, we should probably go ahead and maybe attack these two Austrian armies, defeat them, and stop them from destroying Heidelberg. Seems like a good plan in my opinion. So far, we've done very, very well. This has been amazing. You're healing up though, so that kind of sucks. I will probably get extensive rail system three for you because this area has been kind of on the front lines for quite a long time. So it's time we suit that baby up. 
Should we um, upgrade this? Yeah, we probably should. We should also repair this, and we should... Actually, no, we don't need a navy. Fuck the navy! Get me extensive iron mining networks. I want more money. We're already building all the troops that we can basically man. Tanks, tanks, and more tanks. And by upgrading this university to a research institute, we'll be able to get tech out a lot faster. So. What is on the menu for today? Well, what's on the menu next time around, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, maybe we could attack these two Austrian armies. Then afterwards, we can attack a Ger the German armies over here and the Austrians over here. And once we get the tanks rolling, I think we'll have a massive advantage of over the Austrians and the Germans to the point where they can't fight us. They really can't. Wait, what are we getting again? Female two or are we getting male? Let me check that out. One is anti-infantry, the one of them is not. It doesn't matter, they have more range than everybody. So I wonder, are these the ones with the machine guns or with the, the actual cannons? There are two types. Oh well, I guess we'll figure it out in about two turns. Anyway, my name is Dustin Rolfus. Thank you guys for watching. I know this has been a really long winter campaign, but don't worry about it. It's about to all be over soon. Look at my empire. As we conquer West Prussia. And then afterwards, Austria. We will win the entirety of the game. Hold on a second. Hold on a blooming dick. Where's my objectives? Ah, there we go. Yep, as you can see, two more provinces. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.